Have you ever seen a curtain and thought, oh my god, that'd be an awesome skirt? That's what happened to me. I found this curtain and thought I could really freak a skirt with this. Like, all right. So that's what I'm about to do make a skirt. Grab your material, scissors, pen, seam ripper, tape, measure, needle, and your thread. I don't know if you can hear me because the rain is so freaking loud. Okay, so first thing, I just wanted to show, this is like the loop, I guess, where, I don't really know what these are, because this is where you put your, like, curtain rod through, so, but I just wanted to keep this part because I feel like I could do something with this. So I'm gonna cut that off and then I'm just pretty much gonna cut out like my measurements. Why? Why are you chewing on my product, my fabric? Huh? Alright, so the rain was really loud, so from here on out I'm gonna do a voiceover. The next thing I did was just cut the length of the um, curtain to the size of the skirt that I wanted and then I went in and measured my pleats which I end up making about three inches apart I don't know why my tape measure is going to show you centimeters but I did it in inches so they're three inches apart that's easier and then you want to make your slits when you mark them um, to make your pleats you're going to cross the third one I mean the first one over to the third so you're going to go one over two to the third one so hope that makes sense Trying to figure out your measurements can be kind of tricky. Um, I had two pieces that equaled 14 plus the half inch seam allowance since I'm a 28 inch waist. Um, so I'll put the math in so you can figure out how to do the pleats and all for your waist size. All right, so before you start sewing, you'll just want to iron like your pleats in place. This helps so much, like you do not want to skip this step. So after I repin that piece and ironed it, I began to sew. You can use a sewing machine. Mine is giving me problems, so I did sew this whole thing by hand, but it wasn't hard at all. And the next thing I did was just um, sew that seam together right there. That curtain holder part thing. Yeah, so I pinned that to the waist for like a belt look, and then I'm going to sew that on. Next thing I did was sew buttons on because that's how I'm going to close this. You can also do a zipper, but we're quarantining and I wasn't going to go to the store just for a zipper. I used the seam ripper just to make little holes on the inner lining of the material. And I had buttons. Yeah, so I hope you enjoy my skirt. I love it. <laughs> I'm so clumsy, but this is so much fun to make and try on. I don't really have a lot of girly clothes. Um, so yeah, this is new for me, but this is hella fun. I hope you guys like it, and I'll make more stuff, I think, maybe. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Enjoy. <laughs>